This is my kid's disaster. It's amazing that it only takes a few hours for it to get like this if mom's not paying attention. These are the bins that go under my kid's bed. Um, they fit too high underneath bunk beds and most, uh, you know, twin size beds or whatever. Now, I'm the one that got out these bins. However, if you look under their bed, you can see that they've got all sorts of stuff under there that should be in bins or should be put up. So about every six months, when the seasons change, I go through my kids' clothes, I go under their bed, um, I look for things that they've hidden, I pull couches out, and I look in drawers, and we do a reset. So I limit how many clothes they're allowed to have. Um, Simplified parent or Simplicity Parenting is the book that I love, and it talks about how as your children age, they're able to be more responsible for things, but do not overwhelm them with options. So they have two, they each have two dresses to choose from for church, and in the spring and summer, they just about run around like wild Indians. They will only wear dresses. They don't like to have pants on. So they'll, they'll, wear, they'll wear dresses, and I'll give them five dresses for everyday wear. That way, my laundry isn't overloaded, and I can watch and see if clothes are going through the laundry too quickly, and if they're just putting clothes in the laundry basket because they don't want to put them up. Um, so you can see what kind of mess I'm cleaning up. It's definitely frustrating, but it's it's just where it is. I also go through my husband and my clothes and trade out things that are not seasonal according to which season we're in, and if it is... Um, stained or we put it in like with the kids if I put it in their basket for storage and I brought it out thinking when I put it in I thought it would still fit them later but I brought it out and it they've outgrown it if Kaya has outgrown it I will send it to Salvation Army if Paige outgrew it I save it for Kaya and um, again I really love simplified parenting because it means they only have as many toys and as many clothes as they can actually clean up at any given time and as you can tell lately, my kids' favorite toys have been sewing and paper. So they're they're enjoying their crafting right now. And it'll probably only take them about 10 minutes to clean this up, but I'm going to just go through their clothes while they're not in here and get everything sorted out so they can't object to me getting taking their favorite snow pants and putting them under a bed because it's not winter anymore. So that's what we do.